hi guys welcome to a new vlog um i'm so consistent with it i don't care what nobody says i'm literally in the middle of editing a vlog the one you're going to see soon and i'm already starting another one talk about consistent and persistent anyways welcome to a new vlog so i leave for school in exactly what no two weeks so two weeks from today and <clears throat> have i started packing absolutely not have I started shopping? Absolutely not. Like, I bought some stuff from Amazon, but, like, I haven't done any proper shopping. So, we're about to go shopping. Um, I need to get some dress shirts, um, because apparently I need to upgrade my wardrobe as for a professional, because I ain't got none of that. I got the crop tops. I got the skimpy outfits. But professional? Non-existent. So, we're going to go do some shopping, go to Target as well. So, I thought I'd take you guys along, and obviously, this vlog is going to be, like, pack with me say goodbye with me which I already kind of started, started saying goodbye um pack with me say goodbye to my city um and then go to Barbados I'm actually really really excited um and I'll also be doing some unboxing for the 500 things that I will be ordering from um Amazon even though my Amazon is fucked up but let's not talk about that anyways come with me I prefer this over the ear versus this one but they also have these bows bossy how much are these say something to me say something to me do you love me what do you love me what okay. <laughs> i'm like a big kid Why are you walking away from me? Apparently, because I'm annoying. Okay, I'm done. Sorry, 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 sorry. You don't leave me, don't leave me. Put your hand in mine. You know that I want Guys, I'm stressed. I had a budget for today. I've like tripled that. I've spent triple that. But in my defense, that's what I was gonna say. It's not that I don't need I need everything, but the other upside is there's some stuff that I had like my cart on Amazon or like Walmart online, um, and I found better deals here. So it's like I'm spending more than I wanted to spend at Target, but I'm going to spend less on Amazon. My son's birthday is next week. And that we don't want to have to come back to Target and buy something. So, got him this. Because he likes cars, apparently. Hot Wheels thing. He's turning five, so I feel like that's age appropriate. Hot Wheels thing. And then some more Hot Wheels. I'm a great auntie. Does the kid know I exist? Probably not. Mm -hmm. But his dad is my friend, so why not? I'm an auntie to a kid who doesn't know I exist. Isn't that funny? Like, he's met me once but anyways whatever too many options too many. see i like the feel of this and the color it's cute but pink or like this like purple lilac color would limit me in like the sheets i can get Whereas with a white one, well, white, I'm going to get it dirty because I'm a messy person. I just went with this gray, double-sided, even though I like the feel of the texture of these other ones. But they don't have it in the king. And even though the best. I'm going to take two of these. Oh, that's organization. Oh, yeah. This lotion smells so delicious. I'm going to take two of these. And then one, this is an OG fave. Can I mix them? Do you think we can mix them? <laughs> I'm a Virgo, Lisa is a Leo. Let me smell it. Who smells better? Me. Mine doesn't even smell. It smells like Jikotoro, man. I hope we're not buying this one. Is there somewhere else where they have? It smells like Jikotoro. It doesn't smell like anything. Anyways, guys, finally, finished at target my damage was 265 mind you my budget was 
a hundred dollars. Now we're about to go home. I'm gonna cry a little bit. Spend another two fifty probably tomorrow on Amazon, and then we'll be ready to go in two weeks. Oh my god. Anyways, church. I need to bring sunglasses. I didn't bring sunglasses. Hi guys. Um, so today is Sunday, August 20th. I leave in exactly six days. And so I doing a little cup brunch with some of my friends obviously not everyone could make it i just did like a little thing i think there's gonna be like 11 or 12 of us i guess now 11 of us someone just canceled but it's okay it's okay um so this is today's fit i'm wearing this cute little flora dress not really my style but it's giving i think this is the bag i'm going to go with um it's giving beachy vibes it's giving summer vibes and then for shoes I'm going to wear these little wedged sandals. They're very comfortable. Got them from Amazon. Got them from Amazon. Shout out to Kita for putting me on. Um, you may be wondering what's going on with my hair. So my hair is so old. I've had these twists in for like two months. And so they're unraveling. It looks crazy right now, but I'm taking them off literally tomorrow. If we weren't gonna come home late tonight, I would take them off like right after, but we are probably gonna get home late. And so I did a little huff up, huff down, trying to like conceal it or whatever, but I'm very, very excited to just spend the day with my friends. Um, I told everyone, if everyone's seeing this, I'm so sorry. Actually, I'm really not sorry. I told everyone that reservation was for 1 o'clock, but it's actually for 1.30. So this way, they're all going to be there by 1, 1.15 1 because they're always late anyway. And so by the time the reservation time of 1.30 arrives, everyone's going to be on time. Um, ooh, my watch. Even though all my jewelry is gold right now, I don't have a gold watch, but I have this rose gold, my favorite one that Lisa got me, this Coach Rose Gold watch that Lisa got me for getting into medical school. Um, so I'm gonna wear that. Ta-da! I'll definitely take pictures today, but I'm very, very excited, like I said, to go hang out with my friends, have some mimosas, and just have a great time. So come along with me. Guys, I'm out here with all my favorite people. David, Zizu, Gustav, Lisa, JD, Billy the Goat. Hi, Billy. Mwah. Like, comment, and subscribe. If you want this to be something, give a thumbs up. I'm going to put my Instagram right here. If you want more content from us, please like, comment, subscribe, follow us on Instagram. Like how we met. <laughs> I'll let you guys know how guys. we met, how long we've been together, um, when we're getting married. We're getting married in two years. So I'm actually trying to get the blessing from the sister. Lisa Yans, and she said no. So if we don't have Lisa's blessing, we can't get married. We're gonna get it. Trust me. In two years. In two years. Okay, we got some shrimp and grits over here. French toast and fries, steak and eggs, enchiladas, rice and beans, typical rundin. Um, we have an omelet and some potatoes on the side. What do you have, David? Burger. With eggs in it. Brunch. And then I have some sort of omelet with a biscuit and some fruits. Bon appetit. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Lisa. Happy birthday to you. Woo! Happy birthday, my love. Are you one? Are 
are you too? Um, so my bathroom is a hot mess. My room is a hot mess, which I think is a reflection of my life right now. A hot mess. But I'm going to brunch with uh, my friends from work as well as my boss, but well, my Xbox. Anyways, we're doing a little goodbye brunch for Ines slash birthday because we always do like birthday lunches. But obviously I won't be here for my birthday. Also, I'm leaving. Also, my two year anniversary was like last week, not this week that just ended, I guess the week before that was two weeks ago. And so we're doing it all in together. And this is my fit. And I was given permission to dress casually. So this is me dressing casually, but I'm very excited. Come along with me. We're going to this place called Just Brunch. I've never been. I'm already running late as always, of course, but the food looks good. And I was also given permission for cocktails. Usually we don't, I think I'm only allowed one. Usually we don't do cocktails because we usually go during business hours, but I'm clearly officially unemployed. So I was given permission for a cocktail. I might just get some mimosas, but come along. Also ignore this, listen, just ignore the state of my mirror and ignore the state of my life. Just come along, okay? Guys, so um, now it's the night time. I went to brunch with my work friends and now I'm supposed to have, or I am going to have a little Korean barbecue dinner with my friend Kristen. But we accidentally went to two different locations that are like 40 minutes apart. <laughs> and so since I don't drive, she's coming back to meet me. Uh, but this is why communication is so important because she said the one closest to my house but it was different than the one she was thinking. <laughs> so, now I gotta wait for her. Hi guys, welcome to the unglamorous side of things. I have a stupid pimple on my nose that has refused to go away no matter what I do. And I leave on Saturday. I'm like, I can't pull up to school and meet new people looking like that so we're trying whatever we can um i got notified that i got a package delivered so i'm gonna go pick it up i'm pretty sure it's my camera so let's hope it's my camera let's go i'm pretty sure it's the camera i hope it is because it is from best buy but it feels very light to be a camera let's go and see. <laughs> guys I don't know I'm crying. I just felt like crying. I don't know I'm crying. I mean, I don't know why I'm laughing because I felt like crying a few minutes ago. But um, <laughs> when I say my life is a mess and I'm a joke, you guys think I'm joking. Um, so you know how I just picked up my package and <laughs> I was talking about how the, um, the box felt really light. So I wasn't sure it was my camera. Um, so it was my camera, except the camera wasn't in there. <laughs> oh, okay. Um, so I just, so I just opened <laughs> the box <laughs> and the camera box is in there. The charger is in there. The, um... Um, the battery is in there because it comes separate, but the actual camera is not. <laughs> and I knew something was off as I was walking back because it looked like the box had been sealed and then unsealed. You see this like paper tape thing? It had been like opened, but then it had been taped over with clear tape. So as I was walking, I'm like, this feels off. I kept shaking it and it felt like I don't know but you did not the camera you know what I'm saying so I had this dreaded I had like this like feeling in my gut like oh my fucking shit then I run home I go to Lisa's room and I'm like bro I don't think my camera is in here record me while I do this because again if I have to file a claim I open the box and just like I thought there's nothing in here <laughs> 
I don't know why I'm laughing because I feel like crying. Um, I've literally been looking forward to this since I bought the camera on Monday. Um, and I have clothes on, guys. I've been looking forward to this since I bought the camera. <laughs> it's gone. So I bought it from Best Buy. I should have I should have picked it up, bro. Kind of thought about it. I tried it. I thought about like scheduling pickup, but I was too lazy. I didn't want to leave my house. So I was like, I'm waiting for a call back from Best Buy. Hopefully I can go get the camera sometime before I leave Saturday. Even if I have to go get it Saturday morning, I will get it Saturday morning because my flight is in the afternoon, but I need that camera before I leave. If I can, then I'll actually cry. Not on here because I will never cry on here. But yeah. <laughs> what are the chances? <laughs> it's not funny. I need to stop. I'll keep you guys posted. Guys, let's not talk about what's going on here. But I'm at Best Buy. About to hopefully pick up my camera because they told me to come. But I hope they don't give me any trouble with some BS about something, something. So fingers crossed hi guys um so as you just saw i had no luck picking up a camera um essentially what they told me is i kind of jumped the gun um there like the camera was there or the cameras are there they just there's some kind of there's something in the system the, a process in the system that has to complete fully for them to give it to me and i guess they hadn't completed yet they said to wait for an email i did get an email but that email was just confirmation that my order had been placed i didn't read it correctly or i just jumped the gun it wasn't an email that the order was ready for pickup um which was like a 35 minute drive so i'm mad about that waste of time and i was actually supposed to be after that i was gonna go for like driving lessons with gustav he's been helping me but i just was not in the mood I'm tired. I have a lot of packing to do. I have not packed a single thing. My suitcases are still like not even anywhere near. So long story short, I should not have waited this long to start packing. As always, last minute packer, I'm suffering the consequences of my action actions. Um, so I'm going to start packing. I've decided um, I'm going to vacuum seal everything. <laughs> because I've never vacuum sealed, but I bought like a set of 20. And believe it or not, guys, these used to be two queen size pillows, like the regular, like standard pillows. This is two of them that have been squished to look like this. And this is a comforter, a king size comforter. This is a king size comforter that I have compress which I think I can compress some more into this so what I'm going to do is I'm literally going to put everything that I can in these 20 vacuum seal bags hopefully that's everything and I can fit it in my suitcase so here goes nothing come along with me as I attempt to pack These are all my school supplies guys um at least the like uh mechanical stuff i feel like i'm missing something but let's not talk about that um what do we have we have my stethoscope which actually has my name on it i don't know if you guys can see Ines and goga so got this as a birthday gift thanks mom um we have whatever this is called I think it's like a pocket android whatever it's called and then this is the little thing that they put in your ear oh shoot i gotta remember to buy batteries thank god i opened these um this that little kit this is the little thing they put in by your ear this is the little hammer they hit you with i'm missing something oh i know where it is um but yeah these are the supplies it's getting serious guys happy birthday to you <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Ines Eins. Happy birthday to you. Woohoo! <laughs> I feel 
lo que quieren aquí en la historia. Look what she did. I literally just cried like a fucking baby. This is the best day ever. 20 fucking four. I can't believe it either. But she got all my favorite snacks for me to take to school with me. I'm literally, I cry like a stupid baby. And she got me some new shoes and we're about to pop this. Literally best day ever and I have the best sister in the world. So I went to get my hair done at this African shop and funny enough they all spoke French but I didn't tell them I spoke French so I was hearing them like talking shit about the other customers but they could tell I was African so they didn't say anything about me and um, because again they didn't know I spoke French they actually were complimenting me once I told them I was Rwandan they were like oh le Rwandais ils sont très belles ils ont des tailles blah 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 so I was like okay but anyways, this is, you know the vibes when you think you're almost done, but you're really not. Look at the other half. I genuinely thought we're almost done, but I had a whole other section left, bro. Mm -hmm. um, so we are on our way to the airport. Um, after all the packing I did last, I literally slept at like 3 in the morning. After all the packing I did last night, came out to four check bags and one carry-on or one personal bag everything is literally at exactly 50 or 51 so hopefully they don't stress me about the one pound um we're like 39 minutes from the airport as far as my camera update same thing um it's still at the store still waiting for me just not ready to be released to me i was gonna cancel it and wait for the refund but they said end up today i don't know at this point i don't care i'm over it um lisa is supposed to send me a package of things i couldn't bring in like two weeks three weeks maybe um including my contacts so oh, light. um so i'll just have her ignore my pimple um i'll just have her if the camera is here by then um just include the camera in that box and then fingers crossed nothing nothing happens to it um but yeah going to the airport um i'm about to literally spend an arm and a leg for check back um because american airlines is shitty and their back policy is terrible um so yeah come along with me as we go to barbados well, i'm about to cry guys because saying goodbye to lisa i'm gonna cry like a baby because i am a baby but um My flight is about to board, and I hate hotel bathroom, not hotel, plane bathrooms. But um, I'm about to take off in a little bit. I cried, of course, when I said goodbye to Lisa. But but I would never cry on here. I would never show that because one, I cry ugly. Two. I would said I would never be one of those girls crying on YouTube, but cried saying goodbye to Lisa. All my suitcases were overweight, even though when I was at home, this I think the scales here be scamming. Because when I was at home, I double and triple checked and everything was exactly 50. But when we got here, it was everything, 53 pounds. Two pounds for every single bag? Come on now. So I came out to like $500. So now I'm broke but we made it through um i'm so tired and emotionally drained i'll still record but like y'all will get what you get okay 
Let me go grab a snack. while on board the airplane. The safety card in your seat pocket explains the safety features of this airplane, including the location and operation of exits and flotation devices. So the flight from Miami to Barbados was really only about two hours and 45 minutes, maybe three hours, and I slept most of the way. But guys, the first thing I noticed about Barbados is it was hot. When I say hot, I mean like a heat toe. Like Atlanta's hot, but it was the humidity. And like think of Rwanda times 10, add humidity. That's what it felt like. And I literally almost turned around and got back on the plane to take my ass home. That's how hot it was. Could not do it. Y'all hear them frogs? Yeah, they're everywhere. I'm almost home. I actually remembered how to get home, which I didn't think I would. Hi guys, it's currently like almost, uh, I think 10. It's almost 10, I'm tired. So I'm about to just be on my phone but i'm pretty much settled in for the night um just because of all the bugs people have been seeing and people talked about it before i bought a moustique so that's what this is mind you i haven't slept in one of these in ages and obviously the issue isn't mosquitoes the issue is like crawling bugs because i don't want to like wake up and find a bug on me that's literally my worst nightmare and people have said that the some crawly things i guess because of the heat i don't know whatever the fuck the reason is there are some crawly things everywhere. So I literally came into my little dome with everything I, I need. My AirPods, my eye mask, because I'm going to sleep with the light on. I'm not scared of the dark, but when it's a new place, I like to be able to wake up and be able to see everything. So I'm going to sleep with the light on. I have my water bottle on this little dome. So this is going to be how I sleep until I get comfortable enough. But even then, just for fear of bugs i will never sleep without this thing probably but other than that today was a good first day met some new people made some new friends um just came back from dinner it was delicious as you saw 
Well, all you saw was the food, but I could tell you it was delicious. It was a new day. I'm probably just gonna run errands, buy some groceries, cause my pantry is empty. Of course, my roommates have their own stuff, but I should get my own food, and then start unpacking. Bohoro bohoro, like slowly, but I need to buy more like closet space, like um, storage things, cause that little kaahma that they gave me, that thing right there. I don't know if you can see it. No, you can't. Anyways, the ahma is not gonna do it. So I need to get something else. Um, and it's pretty cool in here. The AC is blowing, so is the fan. So it's pretty cool compared to the rest of the house. But I still have this trusted fan um, that I got from... Oh, this feels so good. It's from Nigeria, but it was given to me as a gift from my old boss. And so when it gets too hot or I just want to feel like a breeze, I do this. So this is sleeping in here with me as well. But anyways, good night guys. I'll bring you guys along tomorrow. But I'm really tired, so I'm about to pass out. Morning guys. Um it's 9.20. I'm late, but walking over to breakfast with my mentors. My mentor and my group mates, whatever. I don't know. Long story short, I slept like a baby. It's still hot as hell, even if it's not sunny. Like, I just left my house two, like a minute and a half ago, and I'm already like missing the AC from my room. But today we have breakfast, signing up for activities for the week. I'm trying to go to the mall. To, I need hangers and stuff like that for my room so I can start unpacking. So we'll see how today goes. Come on! Look at this one. That was the, like, the lighter face. That one right there. I know, there's an orange one right there. Fishies. This is cute. I don't know what the big ones are, but they're. Oh, look at the little one. That is so cute. First of all, I wasn't recording earlier. I was having too much fun. Mostly because we were just chatting shit. And nothing was being done. Second of all, I'm not sure if you can tell, but I just woke up from a delicious nap. And now I have to go to this amazing race field day giving thing, I guess. Some people said it was mandatory, some people said it wasn't. Not trying to get in trouble, but how much trouble would I really get in? It's me. Anyways, I said I would participate in everything they had this week. So here I go. It's like a game night thing where we have to wear our colored t-shirts and play against other teams, I guess. I don't know. My team is purple and we're sea turtles. So, but you see how hot it is. My face stays on sweaty. That's where we're going. Get our shit. Going to school for the first official day of orientation. It's fucking raining. I don't have an umbrella. And the bus stop is like two minute walk from my house. So this is me. <laughs> and my voice. Yesterday we was yelling and screaming. Didn't get home until like 2.30 in the morning. And I'm exhausted. I'm not hungry, but I'm exhausted. First official Bayesian meal. We went to this little mall and I tried bread food for the first time, which I'd only heard about on TikTok and it was really good. Had some fish and this sweet kind of pasta chicken. Delicious. Protein, hydrophobic, or charred? Ray asked me the wrong questions. <laughs> because why is it I so loosely? 
because I was looking at the difference between all of them. Oh, you're still on the questions. Yeah. I forgot about them shits. I don't care. <laughs> oh, what is this? Oh, this is so cute. <laughs> I'm gonna get my name right there. Because of all the yelling from yesterday, I've lost my voice. So for the remainder of this vlog, I will not be speaking. Cause Bro, my voice has never done this. Oh my god. This has never happened before. Anyways, guys, I'll do the voiceover later. <laughs>